Today we're going to measure the line capacity. As you know, the tidal volume is the amount of air in the normal, yeah, or risk state. While the vital capacity is the maximum amount of air that can be breathed in and out. Now we're going to do the first step in our experiment, measuring the, uh, the tidal volume. We're going to take, firstly, we're going to inhale normal breath, then, okay, you will exhale a normal breath but in the spirometer, such like this. Be sure that the spirometer reader is on zero, and then start to blow in it. I'm taking inha inhalation, and then exhale normally. That's it. Read and write down. Here it's about, okay, uh, 1,000. You can write it down. Okay, later, for the vital capacity. Firstly, you have to return it into zero. Okay, after this, you will take a long breath and you will deeply till the end exhale it. You got it? So, take the long breath. Okay. Okay. It should have 3,500. It's normal. As we studied in the Trick Point Science 2, chapter number 5, respiration, the textbook said the normal or the average person is about 4,000. Yes. Now it's your turn. Go ahead. First, the tidal volume. Go ahead. Great. Okay, good. It's about 500. That's good. Yes. Okay, good. He's not doing it right. He's not doing it right. Okay. You didn't take yours. I'm going to give you. Take yours. It's already fixed. Yeah, I'll write it down also. Yeah, remove it, of course. The mouse piece has to be removed. Yes. Start. Yes. Can I ask you, please, what is the midget? 2,700. 2,700. The vital capacity. It's not bad. Good. Yes, here. 2,000. 2,000, the vital. Okay. There's no athletes here that have more than 3,000. Okay. Oh, only one, we do not cheat, man. Only one, only one. Okay. Now, what is your uh, measurement? Please, this group, the leader. First, the first 1,000. Okay, and the second one? Huh?